been hearing some great things about this young man. Kid is powerful, explosive, and huge. I made my UFC debut against Tim Haig. I came in with my jab, dropped him immediately, and then I just cleaned him up with some ground and pound. It was a quick fight. Todd Duffy! I came back at UFC 155. The fight filled the freeze. Huge power shot by Duffy! Todd Duffy with the first round knockout! After I knocked out Phil the Freeze, I end up getting diagnosed with a syndrome known as Parsons Turner Syndrome. You lose function of your arm. It's accompanied with severe pain, loss of coordination, loss of strength. It ended up being about two or three weeks of just kind of a whirlwind of going to every possible doctor I could go to. There was no acute actual injury that caused the situation. They, they couldn't figure out why. And eventually, I had a doctor who was just like, man, and he goes, I really think this is Parsons Turner. No one else wants to tell you that because they know that if they tell you that, that you know, they're telling you that your career is over. Um, I'm not religious, but I'm spiritual. And I was talking to somebody, just arguing like, no, this can't be it, this is not, you know, this can't happen to me. Well, I've given up too much. I didn't want to walk away from MMA yet. I figured I'd give myself two to three years to possibly recover, because sometimes that's the outcome with Parsons Turner. It takes about two full years is the typical recovery. I got lucky, it took me about a year. As soon as I was able, as soon as some of the symptoms went away, I got back in the gym and started training. Eventually I realized that, okay, I am gonna be able to compete at the highest level still. Got all the UFC um, and scheduled the fight. Overcoming all those setbacks, it's allowed me to grow and develop and, and it's, it's established such a sense of self-belief in me that I've never had before as an athlete, as a person. And I truly believe that I can be a UFC heavyweight champion. I will be the UFC champion.